Well, troubling trend, more and more Marylanders are getting addicted to heroin. Authorities say we are on track to have yet another year of drug overdoses and loved ones dealing with loss. WJZ's Amy Yenty explains the epidemic is especially bad in Hartford County. Hartford County Sheriff tells WJZ he's seeing more and more people having drug overdoses, and he says the drugs are getting stronger and deadlier. An inconsolable pain that's tormenting families across Maryland. Nothing ever could be the same again. Our family's not whole anymore. The opioid epidemic growing stronger and more destructive. It didn't seem like anything was wrong. <laughs> And then my mom got the call. Last year, nearly 1,200 people died from drug overdoses statewide, nearly half of those in Baltimore City. So Governor well, Larry Hogan uh, declared the crisis a state of emergency. Working together to finally begin to turn the tide in this difficult fight. In Harford County, County Sheriff Jeff Gaylor tells WJZ heroin overdoses are getting deadlier and more frequent. The loss of life stands at 22 right now, just for this early part of the year. Gaylor says fentanyl, a synthetic opioid, is growing in popularity. It can be up to 100 times deadlier than heroin. When you're taking something that's manufactured that could be 100 times worse, uh, obviously it's resulting in a lot more death here in Harford County and across our country. Some Maryland hospitals are using counselors who battled addictions themselves to counsel patients, trying to reverse the deadly trend to spare families from pain. It's happening in your family somewhere. It happened in my family. It wasn't supposed to happen in my family, and it did. The Harford County Sheriff tells WJZ that many patients have no idea what types of drug combinations they're ingesting. Amy NC, WJZ Eyewitness News. Nearly 90 people in Harper County have had overdoses this year alone. 22 of them have died.